What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Simply Bree. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. Today, I'm going to try the apple cider vinegar um, soaking method for my bundles. Um, as you can see here, I have three bundles and I have a closure, a closure piece. I had this hair in my head for about a good two months, I want to say. Probably two, about, about a month and a half, two months. So I want to clean them real good and then reinstall them. So I'm going to try this method. Now here I'm just running some warm water. And as you can see, I'm using some apple cider vinegar that I got from my local market. I'm just getting the hair ready. See, the apple cider vinegar, you don't have to use that much. Literally just use a little bit. I'm not a fan of the smell of vinegar, so I definitely use only a little bit of that. And what you see I'm doing here now is just soaking my bundles. And I'm going to start massaging the weft of the bundle. Cause that you know that's closer to the scalp so you want to make sure it gets all everything out of it as you can see the water is you know not clear anymore all the products and stuff is coming off of the bundles it's coming off pretty quickly so you just want to make sure you massage the hair you know you don't want to really rub the hair together like that you want to make sure that you're getting the apple cider vinegar water through the bundles I do have rubber bands around the bundles to keep them together I didn't want it to get tangled So yeah, just get your bundles together, um, you know, continue to soak them. You can let it sit for a while. Like, look at this water, y'all. Like, <laughs> the water is clear when we started. Look how much product was on this hair. Like, it's, I didn't even start the, um, the shampoo yet, and it's getting the hair really clean. I saw this method on YouTube. Um, I YouTube everything. <laughs> um, I forgot her name. I'm going to try to find the video again so I can give her a good shout out because, girl, you saved my life when it came to this. So here's the closure. Uh, this closure, uh, I did pre-bleached it. And it had a lot of glue buildup on it. So I decided to let it sit for about like three minutes. Came back. I'm wringing them out. And as you can see, I'm just pulling down on the hair. I'm not like balling it up and twisting it up. It's just a simple rinsing the hair out, run your fingers down it. Look how dirty that water is, y'all. Like, crazy. So, of course, drain your water. Make sure you rinse that sink, sis. Mm -mm, don't want a dirty sink. Um, we're going to prepare the bundles to get clean with shampoo. And in this situation, I am using Prima Nature, my favorite, favorite product. Now, you don't need that much because, you know, you don't want to um, strip the hair too much. So, I'm just going to run my fingers through it. Like I say, I'm not balling the hair up. I'm not scrubbing it like it's closed. I just want to make sure it get through the strands and the well. And I'm telling y'all, my hair, the, the bundles was so soft after I've done it. Like, it was so soft. 
And continue to wash your bundles. Make sure you get every through all the strands. It's a process, girl. You gotta keep going. We ain't done yet. Just continue to wash every bundle. Still washing. <laughs> Now this closure needed some work, okay? So when you're cleaning your closure, you wanna make sure you get all where the glue is at because that part can be real stubborn, especially depending on what kind of glue you use. Yes, look at that closure. I bleached them not. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna condition the bundles. You don't want to just wash them. You want to leave, you know, condition your bundles, but you want your bundles to be soft and flowy. Okay, and the same thing you did with the condition with the shampoo, you can do with the conditioner. Now you want to grab um, yourself a wig brush so you can detangle the hair. You want to run it through the bundles, not nothing like too hard or too harsh. Going to be as gentle as possible so you won't like uh, thin your bundles out. This hair that I got is pretty good. Um, matter of fact, what kind of hair is this? This hair is called B Bundle. I want to say I got it from my local beauty store. Um, I did not get it from the vendor. I just need to do that for And um, it, it doesn't shed that much. I can't say. So just, you know, comb your bundles out. That's so the conditioner can get to every strand. You definitely want to start from the tips first and then work your way up. You want, don't want to put too much stress on your bundles. So make sure you start from the bottom on up. I'm not a, I'm not a beautician, but that I do know. So here I'm just showing you how little shedding that the hair does. Not too much hair at all. I was satisfied with that. Now we're gonna boil the hair. Um, you will wanna have a nice sass pot. Bring it to boil. You wanna add your bundles. Please be careful doing this process because the hair of course is boiling and you do not wanna hurt yourself. Let that boil sis.
give it about five minutes. Now it's time to detangle. If you got your old towel, get your towel. You can put it on the table, lay it out, because the hair is wet. So, you, you know, you want some, something that can catch the, wet, the, the water. You can get you a comb, start from the tips, work your way up, and still start detangling your bundles. As you can see, the hair is coming out perfect. It's super, super soft. It smells great, by the way. You're gonna use this towel to lay your bundles out to dry overnight. You can blow dry, whatever, fix you. So you wanna repeat the process for all your bundles. As you can see, it's a little dark, I apologize for that. All my bundles are laid out. I'm gonna leave it there. So tomorrow, which is now, <laughs> using the right tail comb to comb it out. Now here I'm just rolling my bundles up as if it's you know, not they came in a come in a package. I want to get the bundle together nice and neat. Use a rubber band. You can use a hair bow, whatever you want to use, whatever you prefer. This hair has not been uh, blow dried or flat ironed. This is strictly straight from the pot to air dry to now. Here I'm just showing you the hair, how it's dry, how it dried. Excuse me. It's very soft, as you can see, it has a natural shine. I roll my bundles up. It's very, very flowy. So yes, you brought the bundles back to life. you go girl now you got your bundles it's nice and refreshed clean it smells good it's ready to be curl flutter dried dad whatever you want to do to it you done your thing sis thank you guys so much for tuning in do not forget to comment subscribe like comment and subscribe i'm sorry and hopefully you guys come back to see more of my videos. Thank you guys so much. You guys have a wonderful day. Until next time.